Yeah, 26 pounds. That's not bad. Yeah. All right, you're loaded up, if I loaded up with water, I'd have another two pounds. I would have been at 24. Welcome back, everyone. I'm Nick, and you're watching Smoky Bees Natural. We're down at Land Between the Lakes this weekend for a wonderful three-day trek on the North-South Trail. We'll see you down the trail. All right, guys, North South Trail. Super excited. This is a 60 mile trail that runs the entire length of the uh, Land Between the Lakes National Recreational Area. We're between uh, Lake Barkley and Kentucky Lake. It's a beautiful area. Uh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> getting all excited, I get tongue tied. Anyway, three days. We're attempting to do this about 20 miles a day, so that's going to be a, a tough one to do. It's uh, definitely going to be a challenge for the body. Probably loop or to All right, we're going to follow the white blazes for the next 60 miles. <clears throat> And a beautiful, beautiful uh, view of the Kentucky Lake. Oh, see way beyond back behind me. There'll be some great camping spots, even right here on the beach. It's wonderful. Unfortunately, it's probably one of the few times we'll see the lake this uh, this close. We'll get around a bunch of bays and whatnot and inlets. But man, even for a cloudy day, it sure is beautiful. We're currently on a two and a half mile road walk. Uh, a good portion of the North South Trail was hit by tornadoes this past uh, December, I believe. So, nice little road walk, but man, just look at the destruction. I mean, there's like hardly any trees out here. And the rain is coming in. Man, that's an awfully pretty view. You gotta get your face in your thumbnails, I think, it'll help. That one looked huge. Yeah, he was all flared up, ready to make something. <laughs> Alright, we get really close to him. He doesn't know what the heck's going on. <laughs> He's like, is this another bird? He's gobbling right now. I can see him sticking his neck out. I'm like right on. All right, made it to Isaac Gray Cemetery. I'm gonna take a break for a while. It's been raining. <laughs> We're soaking wet and uh, I'm hungry. So take a moment, eat some lunch and then hope it stops raining for a while. Sun's coming out. Oh, but I can see some gray skies in the in the distance, so oh well. <laughs> I'm hungry. Oh, the wind is blowing in again. And a lovely oak forest right now. But uh skies are getting dark again. I think I'm gonna put my camera away. Maybe get ready for another downpour. Feet are soaking wet. The trail is just a sloppy mess. 
Oh, having a good time though. These old cornfields full of mustard. It's really pretty. I keep pressing forward. <laughs> you can uh, tell from my voice, I am whooped. We have now passed the 20 mile mark via our GPS watches. And I don't think we're quite 20 miles on the trail. I'm not really sure. Every map says one thing. GPS says another. <laughs> anyway, the past 10 miles have been yucky, yucky mud and just rain, <laughs> rain, and rain. So we are all excited to uh, put in the last couple of miles to uh, the south side of Higgins Bay and then we'll start uh, looking for camp. It's four o'clock in the afternoon. It's getting cloudy again. We Thought we could take a rain gear off. I'm not 100% sure we're done with the rain gear, but anywho, uh, my knee is feeling good, my feet are crying, <laughs> and I'm ready for camp. So we'll see you at camp. All right, well, we made it to the opposite end of Higgins Bay. I've now hit my personal best. I think we're well over 20 miles. I think my, my watch says 23 miles right now. Uh, it's five o'clock, the sun is still high, and we're not finding a really any decent camping options. So <laughs> we're a sucker for punishment, I guess. We're gonna push forward and uh, see if we can't make it to a higher ridge. I think it, the trail goes up a ridge here soon, so hopefully we'll get higher, get some uh, drier ground, not so much wash out from floods, and find a really sweet campsite. See you down the trail. All right, we made it to camp. Phone or my watch says that we hiked 25 and a half miles. <laughs> New record for me. Oh man, we're kind of in this valley right now. We barely have any kind of signal, but uh, it's getting late. I'm starving. I got a good dinner for tonight. <laughs> All right, folks, how do you treat yourself to uh, a personal best in mileage? And <laughs> beef stroganoff. We had 41 grams, or 41 grams of protein. Man, and this stuff is good. I've had this on the John Muir Trail and absolutely loved it. Anywho, oh, I'm whooped. I finally got some cell service, so people are uh, checking in with me. And um, I'm tired. So, I'm going to eat dinner, and we'll see you in the morning. Good night. All right, good morning. Oh, it's a nice, cool, cool morning. The birds are chirping. Oh, I want to say I had a good night's sleep, but last night was rough. <laughs> oh, I was sweating profusely last night, and I had to get up three times to get sick in the morning, in the middle of the night. Just, oh, nothing worse than running out of your tent and uh, 
finding a place to take care of business, That's if you know what I mean. So. <laughs> anyway, um, I think we're going to shoot for another 25 mile day. I think we all want kind of a shorter day on the third day because we all have a big drive home. So uh, I think I'm ready. <laughs> my body's healed up. Uh, we had a surprise visitor last night, uh, Terry Boardman, a uh, friend of ours. Uh, showed up at camp right as we were eating dinner so that's kind of wild and then um, we're hoping sometime around lunchtime uh, Chad will even show up he was supposed to come with us and start yesterday but his ankle wasn't feeling well so uh, hopefully you know on lunchtime he'll show up and uh, be able to finish the last half of this trail with us so we'll see you down the trail Alright folks, we've hit the road, we have now officially completed the northern section of the north-south trail, uh, we're right next to uh, uh, Golden Pond, I think we're coming up on that real close, it's a planetarium nearby, so excited to get some, maybe a break for a little while and then hit the uh, southern section, halfway there. So we have begun the 10 mile muck fest. <laughs> oh, the trail now is 10 miles of horse trail and it is all, all mud. It's lunchtime. Let my piglet tear out. Got some cheese and salami. I've already had a tuna taco. What you got, Samuel? All right, now I'm just eating gummy worms. Gummy worms. Beef, beef jerky. Beef jerky. And what you got there, sir? Green belly. Green belly meal to go. Cranberry almond. All right, well, the sun is trying to come out, so we're taking a break, hoping that Chad will show up soon in the next uh, road closure, or not road closure, but road crossing. And uh, we'll have one more to the group. How you doing, buddy? Good, how are you? Oh, we're out, man. I'm wore out. I bet. Look who just showed up. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. 
All right, finally made it to camp. Man, I'll say it again. What a day. Oh, we put in 21 uh, miles today. Half of that was super muddy, mucky horse trails. I mean, just pulse tolling through mud. We spent miles uh, just bushwhacking just to get around some of the stuff. And, uh, you know, yesterday I, I talked about uh, my knee pain. I didn't have any of that today, but I, uh, for some reason, had some serious shin splint issues today. So 21 miles on shin splints is no joke. Oh, but I'm in my tent. The guy's got a fire going, so I'm going to get out of here and uh, get some food going and hang out at the fire. I'll show you that. But I got to get my boys back because you're going to love to see these feet. They're always showing their nasty feet. Check this out. Isn't that a gnarly mess? Uh, I got a couple blisters trying to come up. But man, you can see all the caked on mud from all the nasty trails. I'll save you from the rest of the gore, but anyway, get something to eat. Let's see in a little bit. All right, tonight's dinner is sweet pork and rice. I've tasted this before on other trips. I can't wait to have one just for myself. Yummy. You have a trail, man? I just was thinking the same thing. Yeah. I was Bye like, now. dude, if you don't have a trail name, there's one coming. All right, well, that wraps up day two. Had a wonderful time around the campfire. Oh, nice and full. I'm tired. Got 15 more miles to end of this trail, so I'm getting excited. So we'll see you in the morning. Good night. All right, good morning everyone. It is day three, 14 more miles and we've got this one in the bag. Getting excited to get this one done. How about you guys? Let's do it, let's do it. All right, here we go. We'll see you down the trail. Right, it has been an absolutely beautiful morning. The sun is out, the sky is blue. I uh, listened to all the birds chirping this morning. Kind of helping me forget the shin pain that I'm having today. Uh, yesterday, 20 miles on shin pain <laughs> was no joke. And then doing another 14 today, it's going to be a test of some uh, mental and pain issues to overcome, I guess. But anyway, having a lovely morning. Oh, the sound of those birds. <laughs> All right, we'll see you down the trail. I'm not sure if y'all can tell that or not, but my ankles are swollen like apples. <clears throat> Terry grabbed my pack. At least he's going to carry that for me for a while, but we got another 11 miles to go. Uh, slowly but surely, we'll finish the trail. What do you think your pack is? It's not over 20. No, when I started, my pack was 25 with three yeah. three days full of food. Yeah, I feel yeah. like you got 20 pounds and I've got about 15, so I'm only carrying 30 yeah. pounds. <laughs> it's just awkward because of the front load. Like, yeah. Because I can't see my feet. That's funny.
that breeze. All right, folks. Last two miles. Hobbling for the past 10 has been brutal. But uh, Terry came in clutch for me and has been toting my pack the whole time. Oh, my ankle looks like a bad, big old apple. <laughs> oh, but super excited. We're almost done. And I'm just dreaming about that post-hike meal. <laughs> Good job, good job. Congrats. Congrats, Nick. All right. All right. There you have it, folks. The North South Trail, 60 miles, three days, and a wonderful time with good friends. Till the next time, don't forget support, support your local, local beekeeper. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Oh no! Oh, I didn't have my camera on. <laughs> Blooper time! Oh, do you have your camera rolling? <laughs> yeah, awesome. Oh, I can't wait to see that playback. Okay. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about! <laughs>